Welcome to Storytelling for Kids. The title book for today is The Year of the Elephant. All living things are under command of Allah Subhanahu wa ta'ala and in this story we're going to learn about the birds that were sent from the sky to destroy the army of an evil Abraha. These very tiny birds have been mentioned in the Holy Quran in Surah Al-Fil. Our Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam was born in the year of the elephant. In that year, the tyrant king of Habasha and his big army of the elephants headed towards Masjid Al-Haram in Mecca to steal the Hajar al-Aswad and to destroy the Kaaba. This was Mecca at that time. In those days, Mecca was known for its trade because goods used to come from some countries named Syria, Iraq, and Yemen. Abraha, the bad king, had built a big temple in Habasha and had decorated it with gold and silver. He wanted to steal the Hajar al-Aswad so that people would come to his temple instead of going to the Kaaba. He did not realize that Kaaba is the house of Allah. Abraha and his army surrounded Mecca. They are determined to attack the Kaaba. The people of Mecca did not have the strength to defend the house of Allah that was built by Prophet Ibrahim salam. Abdul Muttalib advised the people to leave their homes and go to the mountainside and pray to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to help them. Abdul Muttalib the grandfather of the Holy Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alaihi wasallam went to meet Abraha because he wanted his camels back. Abraha expressed his surprise that Abdul Muttalib never asked anything about Kaaba. In response, he told him that the owner of the Kaaba would take care of his house. The Lord of the house will protect his house. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will protect Kaaba. Just before the final attack, the biggest elephant would not move any further, even though they tried very hard to push it. A large flock of birds, each carrying stones in their beaks, were sent down by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to destroy the army. The peoples hit Abraha and his army. No one survived. A few men returned to Hanasha to inform the people of the death of Abraha and his army. Abdul Muttalib and the people of Mecca thanked to Allah. The birds of Ababil returned to the skies. This story was written in Quran Surah Al-Fil. The end. Thank you for listening and see you to the next story. Bye.